Well, there it is. Little grey streets and chimney pots and children. A little world that changes and yet does not change. My world, I suppose you'd call it. That's me with Laddie, beginning our day early. Now is the time for seeing things so many people miss. Quiet streets. And look at this, horse riding into our hamlets. The paper boy, half awake, but earning his pocket money. And the council lorry still asleep in the yard. But it's a lull before the storm roll. Here they come with their breakfast barely down. Buses, cars, there's Miss Walton. More kids, cars and lorries. And then, emptiness. Now the high pipe sweeps the steps. And Ernie delivers his pointer. And oh, there's his rival. Liked having his photograph taken. And after you've seen to the drains, Everything stops for a cup of tea. People think our hammocks are a drab place, but just walk and see the pride of the people. Look at the dignity of these houses possess. People never stop painting around here. And how is this for pride? Shangri-La. But here in Jedenshire Road, there's a real Aladdin's cave. Mrs. Duncan is a well-known children's author. And all these paintings are done by her. So you see, it isn't all bricks and mortar. Tower Hamlets is threaded with these quiet, leafy lanes. with a fairy castle at the end. Look at these flowers. Tiny gardens ablaze with colour. Places where an old man can remember and an old woman can dream. And look above these roses to the red Dutch tiles. That's where Ta Hamlet really began. When Napoleon overran the Netherlands, our Dutch tile imports stopped. So we had to make our own. And the clay found here in Ta Hamlets began a new industry. That's where the Tahamut water supply stood. And the house is built round the old tower or pump house. Incidentally, this gentleman 
Then wanted to show us just more than bricks. He wanted to show us his cottage that hides in this quarry, ringed by trees. And his pets, that's the goat and his playmate. And the 20 year old seagull. This seagull comes back here regular every year. Still on the history side, this very smart pub stands on the site of the old Black Horse Inn. And from roughly in the window area, people could hire seats to watch the hangman at work. Over there where Dean's now stands, many a good Dover gentleman swung while his neighbours bunched sandwiches. No, we don't forget the past easily, and the local primary school children still dance round the maple. One of our schools is so old, the bricks still bear the marks where our grandparents shot their slate pencils. We haven't forgotten the future. In a few months, this exciting looking place will take many of our Tar Hamlet senior pupils. Yes, there's always something to look at going on in Tar Hamlet. A warm, friendly place with room for the old at the front door. where children can still play on the pavement, where women can gossip, where the corner shop is always open. Yes, this is my Tower Hamlet. My little world, I suppose you'd call it. And so we go home, not to a goblet of wine or a brace of partridges, but to a good old British cup of tea.